When Megan and I started our relationship, we were off and running right from the beginning. We knew from the start, despite being remote, that we were meant to be together. So for this episode of Stacey Links Presents, I would like to go through all the points that Megan and I feel that have brought us together in this relationship. I'll be right back. So welcome to my channel. I'm Stacy, and in this episode, I'm going to talk about how Megan and I knew that her and I were meant to be together, despite the fact that we met on social media and we lived 1,600 miles apart. Now we are physically together. She is living here with me now, so this episode will talk about the things that brought us together and solidified our relationship. Before I get started, what I'll get you to do if you're new to this channel and you're a transgender person interested in fashion, makeup, and jewelry, make sure you go down below in this video and hit that subscribe button and click the little bell beside to be notified 30 minutes before each of my vlog premieres and anytime I upload new content to my channel. I have playlists with videos with my makeup routines, tips and tricks, and product reviews you will love to see. Plus I'm doing advocacy for the LGBTQIA community and documenting my journey as a transgender parent. Also be sure you're following me on social media. I'm on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and on TikTok. Check the description below in this video for all my social media links. So right from the start, one thing that Megan and I noticed is that her and I have very similar personalities. Like we pretty much mesh when it comes to our personality interaction and we're able to interact in so many ways that I've never experienced before. Another point is that we have similar points of view on many things in the world, which is great because her and I are both realists and having similar points of view means that we both agree on many different things. The other thing that we noticed is that our maturity and intelligence levels do match, that we are both highly intelligent and we are quite mature as well. So those types of things really bring us together and having great communication really helps in that. We also noticed we both have the same sense of humor. We can joke around a lot and there has been no dull moment whenever we've been joking around and making funny jokes and make funny faces and we really have lots of fun together. Something else we have in common is similar spiritual beliefs. We both have the same spiritual beliefs. We believe in psychics and mediums. We believe in paranormal. We both also believe in extraterrestrial and we're interested in astronomy and astrology. And leading into that as well, Megan and I do have a number of common interests. We both have a passion for music. We are both emotionally driven by music and we like a lot of the same music. We're also both gamers. Megan likes to play video games and board games and card games and we like that too. So we've come together playing games online while Megan was still back in Virginia. And one of the games that Megan and I played the most is Call of Duty Mobile. And even to, to this day, we still play that game on a fair regular basis. Another big interest that Megan and I have together is history. We'll talk about history subjects on a semi-regular basis, but we both love watching historical videos, seeing old pictures, and hearing about historical events. So just to summarize, Megan and I felt like we have so many things in common, and just the way we connect and the way we interact together, all of it together just leads into the relationship we have. Megan and I absolutely believe that we are meant to be together for life. All right, so thanks for watching. Make sure you smash that thumbs up button down below and drop a comment if you're in a relationship. Tell me something that brings you and your partner together. And make sure you stay tuned for my next episode. I'll see you then. Bye.